Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Marcella Doran and today we are going to be doing a wearable pump unboxing and review. I did purchase this from Amazon and when I purchased it from Amazon, it started out being $45 and I used a promo code that I found on TikTok and it went down to $41. So this is the pump. It is the Fampy E Shine Double Electric Breast Pump. And it has um, two of the cups and it has a motor. Um, each cup, I believe, holds three and a half ounces for a total of, of seven ounces or each cup holds seven ounces. We're gonna find out as soon as we open it up. I have not opened it as of yet. So um, it has four modes, it has eight levels. Um, it has a rechargeable battery, it is hands-free, and it's something that you can use while on the go. So here it goes. So let's open it up. So here's, uh oh, here's one of the cups, which of course I am going to, I am going to sterilize these before I use them. Here's one. So, yeah, so they each hold seven ounces. It says it on the side. So they each hold seven ounces of milk, which is awesome. And it has a 20 flange, 20 millimeter flange insert here which is good because I just found out, I just found out from using this that one of my nipples is a 20 and one is a 19. I've been using 21. Um, the main reason I even did a 21 is because when I'm engorged, they're at about a 21. So there's two, two of these, boom. And this is the, rechargeable motor come on so this is the rechargeable motor it has um, the ability to use one or two hookups the power button is on this side the charge port is here and it comes with the um, USB charger. And this is the digital screen, which it has a little fake screen right there. And I believe that this right here is like a, a lanyard um, loop so that you can be able to wear it on you or to be able to use like a hook or something and wear it on you, which is pretty cool. It's not too heavy. It's light enough to carry around with you, but um, we're gonna try it out. Um, I originally bought this because it is compatible with my um, Spectra pump. Um, like I showed you guys in previous videos, I did get a breast pump through my insurance called the Motif Luna. Um, I thought that that one was a hands, I thought that that one was a rechargeable breast pump, but it turns out that it was not. Um, my insurance didn't cover the rechargeable one, so it is a wall pump. I also have showed you guys my Spectra S1 and S2 that I got from a thrift store for a dollar each. So it is compatible with the Spectra. So I got it originally because of that. Um, at first I was going to order just these, just the, the cups, because you can order the cups by itself on Amazon for two, it's $36, which I may end up buying two more so that I could be able to have backup just like all of my other stuff. If I show you guys my little pump part drawer or collection, you're going to be like, why? But it's trial and error when it comes to this stuff. Okay. Um, but you can buy this, I think they're $16 a cup. And I hope that it works out good. 
This Spectra pump is strong. I got this pump for $1. I got two of them. One is rechargeable, one is a wall pump. This mess is strong. When the first time when I put it on it, I was like, it scared me because it was nothing like the Motif Luna. So the Spectra helped my supply to come back up. I wanna keep it up and I wanna be able to store enough milk to have just in case, because you never know, you just never know. Cause I hear about supply dropping when your cycle comes on or, you know, if you're not eating enough calories, protein, whatever things happen. So I wanna make sure that I have enough milk saved up. Um, and if you, if you guys hear grunting and noises, that is my baby. He is currently in his swing, fighting his sleep. Well, not really fighting his sleep, but he's swaying. He's in there swaying. But yes, yeah, so we're going to go ahead and wash these and sanitize these because I am a little, I'm not going to say backed up, but I am full right now. I did feed baby and within the last third, within the last hour, I did feed him, but I need to empty out my breasts. And that was something that I was not doing before or that the pump that I was using was not doing before. It was not emptying out my breast. One, it could be because of my flange size. Two, it could be because of the strength of, um, of the pump. I wasn't using like a higher strength. I was using like three suction strength. Could be because of that, but um, I'm still gonna use it, so. Oh, Tay. So we're going to go ahead and charge this up. I am going to use this first, see how that goes. And then I'll switch it over to my Spectra to see if there's anything left over that needs to be emptied out. So let's take a little break. Baby boy needs my attention and I'll be right back. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and put this back together so i have the cup um this is a part of the valve so this silicone part goes on to here okay and then this is the duck bill it goes over that right there boom this attaches inside of here oh i put that in backwards so that goes in there boom and then this part goes into this hole right here. But well, actually, let's attach that part first. So attach that, then attach it here. And then snap it all the way around. And then put the insert right there. Boom. So now we have these. 
and these are extra duck bills. So let's slide back into the room. Okay, so now they are clean. And let me show you the rest of what it has in here. So it has the cords. This is the tubing. It connects right there. Okay, so they connect there. And let's unhook this. And then these connect right here. which it seems a little, a little hard to put it on. Okay. So you just wanna make sure it's really in there. Okay, let's test it out. So I'm guessing that's the expression mode. Alright, so I'm going to put it on and then we're going to look through this manual and see see what it do Okay, let's go. I'm not even gonna lie, kind of hurts. Um, let's see, how do I switch? It's like it's milking me like I'm a cow right now. It's like. Okay. It lets you turn that off. Cause I'm saying like, this is not working for me. <laughs> so this button right here changes it from going to just okay I could I could deal with that 
so. Ooh. Level three is good. So we're gonna do this for 20 minutes. I'll, well, I'd say 25 minutes. I'll be back and I'll show you guys what I got. Twenty-seven minutes. So we're gonna go ahead and stop it because it feels like I am empty. Um, we're gonna take it out, see how much milk we have, and then we'll go from there. So let me take this off. Hey you guys, here's day two of me using the Fampy wearable, Fampy eShine double cup wearable pump. Um, I tied a charger around a little loop thing so that I could try and move around and get some stuff done today. Um, this is my third time using the pump since yesterday and the battery is dead it just died on me in the middle of my third session which this session was a little bit longer because i went 28 minutes then i paused it it turned off then i turned it back on maybe went about 10 more minutes and now it is dead so let's see if i try and turn it back on that's what it looks like when it's dead so now I'm going to go ahead and charge it. Um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and switch the tubing over from this to my Spectra pump. Um, and just, just because you guys are here and I just did this, I just restocked, stocked up my snacks so that I can try and stay, um, 
you know, keep my nutrition going because I be hungry in the middle of the night, you guys. Like, savagely hungry. Um, but yeah, just wanted to update you guys. Three pump sessions, three and a half, I would say, pump sessions, and it's it's dead after an hour. Let's say an hour and a half. So, hour and a half, it died. All right, you guys. Peace.